Hi, I'm Diane Wallace, and this is Adorama TV. Today we're talking about the Ricoh GR. It's this great new compact camera from Ricoh, and this is the fourth digital generation of this camera. The ones in the past were fun, they were fast to use, but they had a really small sensor, and so they didn't have necessarily have the best image quality. But this one leaves those others in the dust. The sensor in this camera is a 16 megapixel APS-C sensor. Now, I'm gonna give you a comparison. This is a Pentax K52S, and you can see the difference. This camera has the same size sensor as this one. So it really makes a difference in the image quality. The ISO range on this camera is really good. It starts at 100 and it goes all the way up to 25,600. And that's gonna give you amazing range in lots of different situations. In our tests, we found that the image quality was excellent up to ISO 1000 and really good up to 3200. You're gonna get great images. The GR is made with a magnesium alloy body, which makes it really durable, and it's got this great grip on it, so it's kind of hard to drop, which is nice. Let's talk about the lens. It's a 28 millimeter equivalent lens. It starts at f2.8. It's gonna give you beautiful bokeh, especially with the nine leaf aperture in it. It's also optimized for the sensor of this camera, so it really is all gonna work together, and it retracts, which is very nice when you turn it off, you could stick it in a pocket and go. One of the really nice features about this camera is that it's almost entirely customizable. So you can set up the camera to shoot the way you shoot rather than having to relearn to accommodate the camera, which is great. It's so customizable that you can even reassign the shutter button. And if you see the back, it's really easy to access. It's laid out really well. It's very intuitive. Let's talk about the focusing features on this camera because it does some special things. Of course, you're going to find autofocus and manual focus. You'll find tracking for your subjects. Um, it does all the things you'd expect, but there's something special that really differentiates this camera from the others. It's called snap focusing. And what that means is that you can set the distance in meters or in feet to program so that it goes automatically to that distance. So when you press the shutter all the way down, and normally we're used to pressing halfway to get it to focus, but if you press it all the way down, it's gonna go automatically to that distance that you've set. And that's really convenient if you're a street shooter or if you're a photojournalist, and you need to get something on the fly, you can just snap it and go and know that it's gonna be shot. There's a really high resolution LCD screen on the back. It's three inches and it's more than a million pixels. You're gonna have beautiful quality on the back. Now this camera doesn't come with an optical viewfinder, um, but, we have some, and we'll put on the screen for you some of the options that we carry at Adorama. I'm gonna show you this Voigtlander. It slides right into the hot shoe. And look how cool it looks. It's very steampunk. I love this. Some of the other features of the Ricoh GR include being able to turn the sound off on the shutter or turn it down, but that's really important if you're a street photographer or even a photojournalist, you need it to stay quiet. And at this size, it's really unobtrusive as well. So. It's really nice to have those features in this camera. We also can do real-time Kelvin white balance, and you can see it on the screen as you're changing the temperatures. That's very cool to have. Of course, 1080p HD video. It's not what the camera really focuses on, but it's an awfully nice option to have. This camera shoots both RAW and JPEG files. You could even shoot them together at the same time if you wanted. The RAW files are DNG format which is really nice to have. You don't have to worry so much about raw converters or your software reading your files. They also capture 14-bit information. That's a lot of data to get. When you're shooting with a camera that's got 16 megapixels and all this image quality, you really do want cards that can keep up, especially with your transfer times. You don't want to be weighed down waiting for your image files to transfer out. So we have uh, a Lexar 600X SD card, which is really fast. It's going to really help you save time for some of us, time is money, so that's a good thing. The Lexar card reader that I'm holding right here is a dual slot. It does SD cards as well as CF cards, and it's USB 3, which is really fast, maybe even faster than Thunderbolt. A number of us at Adorama took this camera out to test drive it, and what we found was that the image quality is terrific. It really rivals other cameras that use a sensor that's an APS-C sensor, like the Pentax that we saw earlier. Um, it's, the quality is excellent. 
As far as focusing time, it is super fast. We found almost no lag time in focusing. And even an autofocus, it's really much faster than the other compacts that are out there on the market right now. The Ricoh GR is a terrific little camera. After testing it out, um, we really found that the image quality is great. It's fast, it's sharp, it's very lightweight. It's an excellent camera for photojournalists, documentary photographers, anybody who needs to shoot sort of unobtrusively um, and still get great images that print really well and that look really sharp. We love this camera. I love this camera. This camera is now available through Adorama.com or in our store. And there's more information on it, even more details on the Adorama Learning Center. So make sure you look for the article. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you soon. For all the latest photography, video, and computer gear, visit Adorama.com. Place your order by 8 p.m. and it ships the same day. Plus, next time you're in New York City, be sure to visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.